you guys? It's Nampro and welcome back. We have an advanced supply drop opening today. Once the advanced supply drop, we're gonna get into the gameplay. But let's open this up and get some free for all. Let's go. We got that bulldog Mancy. Let's go. That's some hype. Um, but yeah, so Black Ops 3 will not have like as excessive skill-based matchmaking as advanced warfare. It'll go back to the same traditional style. Like the older Call of Duty is like Black Ops 2. It's gonna be just like Black Ops 2's uh, skill-based matchmaking. Cause yes, there's been Call of Duty. Call of Duty's had skill-based matchmaking since Call of Duty 2. If you guys did not know that already, it just hasn't been a, like it's been mostly like on connection and a little bit of like the skill-based matchmaking. And yeah, that's some hype right there. So that means we can like dominate some more people. I, Cause I, it's sad like. How you can't like just sit back and not go competitive like the whole time, which I, I really I really miss. I really miss. I wish this game had it. This that would make this game amazingly good. It was good for the first couple of weeks, so I miss that. For for reals. And I saw the sneak peek of like this C4 C4 sandwich, like little ass pack. If you guys saw that one screenshot, it was pretty nice. I want that C4 back. That C4 was like <laughs> life. C4 is for life, man. Like, I don't know what I could have done without it. Like, it made Call of Duty fun. Damn, what's going on? We're doing bad. But it made, it made Call of Duty fun. I also saw that Remington 870. I think it's called the KOS 274 or something like that. That looks sick. I like those shotguns. Those are the ones that, like, that made Black Ops too fun for me. Oh, shit. We got turned on. Advanced Waffles going on a roll. Uh, yeah. Uh, so shout out to my boy Cuddle Cakes. He reached 50 subscribers trying to do a day in a life video. So I'm gonna help him out with that. Yeah, congrats to him. We re just reached 723 subscribers today. That's just amazing. And 125,000 viewers on YouTube. It's just amazing, guys. Um, for reals. I, th I had to thank you guys for that. 720. Like, less than last month, we were at 640 something. I just can't thank you guys anymore how much you guys are supporting me. We're on the road to 1K officially. I'm trying my best to do good commentary. Yeah, so good commentaries always count. I love good commentaries. I really, really wish that um, Black Ops 3 will have a good storyline because I just missed that old storyline. I heard, I saw that uh, Hudson's going to be on... One of the main characters or one of the main uh, boss zombies in Black Ops 3 Zombies. So I can't wait for that. I also heard they're going to be replaying some old Black Ops 2 or 1 missions. What I heard, I'm not sure about like all of this, but I know that that's that, that might be fake. And you, there's this leak about Nuketown 2065. How you guys can like just get, get Nuketown 2065. It's going to be built in the game, I guess. Because how is there going to be a Black Ops without Nuketown? That's just... If they don't add it, they'd be stupid enough to not add it. So... There's going to be Nuketown, no doubt, unless they're stupid, but, yeah, another thing I like is a special, specialist, whatever, whatever you guys want to call it, the super power bonus thing, whatever I want, that was pretty sick, I like it, I just love that super power bonus, but, w tell me what you guys think down in the comments down below, what you guys think about all this stuff, uh, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe, more videos coming tomorrow, and, yeah, I'll see you guys later, peace, and, don't forget to use our code, Zero Uprising for 5% off on all Cinch Gaming products, and yeah, that's it, guys. I'll see you guys later. Peace.